Welcome back to Chimo Chills. Take a look. We have a little bit of unrest problems. We have rebels all over the land. You can hardly even see my armies anywhere. It's almost like we're in some trouble here. So let, let's let's get out of this predicament we're in. We are in, a, of course, we are in the court and country uh, disaster, which is good in the long run. It's gonna it's gonna make things interesting in the short run. We have a ton of rebels. We have a 76,000 doom stack, death stack, sitting on our capital, which I don't know who who I'm going to get back there to even smack them away. I, honestly, I'm not sure, but we're going to make it happen. It's going to happen. All right. So this Navy has got to finish up its mission out here. I, I did not know it was going to take this long out here. Oh, I don't have a leader on there. That's a misplay on my part, not the end of the world. So we're coming up there. You're coming up there to meet them. You're sieging that. You can do little but train. So you might as well go train. You can go sit with them and train as well. 20,000 stacks doing nothing. And 30,000. Yeah, you're desperately needed. Absolutely. Head down to, uh, to Rome. For sure. There you go. So that's another province taken. So we'll head down to Rome too. So there, there's a total what eighty thousand troops down there, eighty thousand rebels to deal with. So not nothing. All right, first little, first little rebel stack. No big deal. Ulm will automatically be lifted, so I don't need to uh, get there myself. To join them in their training seems like a wise thing to do. So it makes more sense to get them joined up. That way, they're both using the uh, the leader advantage there for the movement. So join you up, and you can go straight down to Rome. Now let's find who who does nothing. Am I mistaken? Oh no, okay, no, it, it is being lifted. Okay, to Zagrab. 55,000 with a good general. You know what? We're going to go lift that. We're going to go lift the capital. That's where our priority is. More rebels. We need more rebels. 11,000 out there. Why not? That's what I say. The more the merrier. Bring on zero. Oh, that was a mistake. I didn't want you out there. I didn't want you to break your siege. So I'm not worried about dealing with these, these, uh, these Brittany... Brittany factions, I kind of have a, a big army, stonking army sitting over there already. So this, this port is on this side. So right away we leave. Are you loaded up? Yes, you are. And are we going to get to Algoa Bay in time to save them? I think I'm going to leave that army there. I'm not going to actually bring them back to Europe. And that will be a, that'll be my African Corps. Fortunately, I can't raise the autonomy there yet. So if there's another rebellion there, there's another rebellion. It's almost like this court and country thing is uh, designed to give you a little bit of rebellion. Especially if you're a big stonking empire. Alright. Yeah, you're stuck doing nothing, I know. Back. We'll take fight with Morocco. We still have a ton of manpower, so... It's just our economy. Can't we, we can't just build infinite armies right now. We are losing money. A lot of money per month. So our, our economy is, is feeling this. Do, do, do. Can we get out of the negative? No, we can't. We don't even have enough uh, Diplo points to spend. The Sparta! Yeah, save the capital! Get off of the capital. Rome will be brought back under the fold. Losing a whole bunch of siege with having Rome, Rome occupied there. Uh, a correction, uh, trade, trade. Losing a whole bunch of siege. That doesn't make any sense. So we are going to pay down that war exhaustion. We are going to boost the stability to zero. Feels good. Stability at least zero. Fewer rebel control provinces than one. And disaster has been active for ten years. Oh, we have to have the disaster for ten years. Well, fine. Whatever. So be it. 
Uh, a prestige loss for some pre free lo uh, nobility loyalty is a no-brainer. So that army lost, eh? And they're in, they're in a shattered retreat. So we'll move forward. I got 99% on Morocco. There's there's not actually any point in continuing this going. Unless I want this this lower. Ah, we got a couple... Alright, we'll, we'll, we'll let those couple provinces finish up. It'll be done before the end of the year. Not that aggressive expansion ticks are, are really that important <laughs> anymore. We did get here, so I'm going to immediately go inland, and my navy goes home. We'll grab an army in Haha. -ha. It can be this, 14,000, once they stop running. <laughs> Whenever you're done running, you, you, you're going to be brought back into another war. And we will go south to deal with the, uh, the Mamluk Separatists. That's what we wanted, that whack of cores to finish. Take a peek. We're at 62% with a... Oh, another 20% coming soon. Morocco. That would be 63% overextension. Oh, do I want to do it? I kind of want to do it. I don't want them to have a coastline anymore. Okay, if that's the case, we're going to wait till the end of the year then. I'm not going to wait for the, those other provinces to be completely cored. I'm just going to wait till the end of year. They'll be that much closer to be cored. Alright. 50,000. Come down that way. We're getting the rebels under control. We're getting the rebels calm. Things are calming down. Things are calming down. You can always do some mock speed 5. It's always fun. See, that's what we're talking about. So, oh. These are both? Um, so, 60,000 manpower and 5 absolutism or we'll lose money and we get no no we'll take the manpower for sure that's that's yeah <laughs> thank you that's a great a great little random event so let's make sure Castile likes us a lot so we'll top up our relations with him and then we are going to jump down Morocco you need, we need peace. We need peace with you, Morocco. We're going to take all of your coastline, the war reps, and the money. 500 Ducats still. I'm impressed. And there you go. There's no more raiding. Oh, no. I'm, I'm totally wrong. There's there's Tunis right there. Well, I'll have a neighbor. I'll, I'll have a border with Tunis now. So it, it'll be no issue. Uh, that's the case. Should I just run this army back down south? Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. I know I was just running them north. I don't know what I'm doing. We're, we're running north and south and back and forth. I will sail the, the army directly past. Um, past picking up the army and open up the channel way so I can get onto Ireland. Mm -hmm. Clear you out. And it looks like we got another merchant from somewhere. I'm not sure what tr changed. Transfer. Oh, it's 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 a case of I'm I'm getting and losing a merchant. I'm like, I have just on the cusp of the most, and then I lose it. We'll take the extra influence in Alexandria. Lots of money to be made there. Rome does not want to just come back to the fold. There's the navy. So that's what I was talking about. I'm gonna sail them up first. Let's get on to Ireland. This is priority. Are we going to fight them on the way? No, I definitely... I have rebels. There you go. So the decision itself gives me rebels. That's awesome. I love it. I haven't done too many of these court and countries. I've done a couple. It's not my It's not my very first one. But it's... I, I, I won't say I've had a, a huge experience with them. Oh, wow. I, I went way over my force limit. I didn't realize I went that far over. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm going to be sitting getting more negative uh, pop-up, random pop-ups. So be it. 
There is the English Navy. Please tell me I have a leader. No, I don't have a leader, but neither do they, thankfully. And they decided to retreat. Hello. Uh, let's get a leader on there. Thank you. And... Yeah, whatever will be converted first. Makes the most sense to me. You can get onto that border with Tunis. Do I peace out Great Britain? I'm across the, the strait. Surely their their war exhaustion has got to be through the roof by now. I've been sitting on their capital a very, very long time. I was sitting on most of their country a very, very long time. Alright, let's get out. Unseaging the lands. Mm -hmm. Oh, let's go south. What's going on here? Oh, that's not even my... Those are Yemen Mamlukun Separatists. Okay. That's fine. Then you can keep on being Yemen Mamlukun Separatist. So I had I had no one going that way yet. Uh, there's Rome. So get on to the Naples Separatists and then their, their capital. And I need you back to the mainland. This 80,000. Oh, I need you on the mainland so bad. Yeah. So I just leave that those pop-ups to the side because I am going to get a whole bunch of them. Uh, again, you take every single thing that'll give you absolutism in this, and at the end, you're you're left with a whole whack of uh, permanent max absolutism that just stays stays with you as a modifier. So that's why you take even though there's negative pop-ups happening there, you just take them anyways. Oh, they went to Morocco. Went to war with Tunis right away to get a coastline back. Sneaky boys, sneaky boy, Morocco. Well done, sir. That's intelligent. All right. They are fast traveled. More rebels. We're gonna just have these pop ups. We gotta go get these. What are they? Portuguese separatists. We don't want them there. So there's only one anyone close to doing anything is the Portuguese apparently. And then we're gonna get some Cornish rebels, but I don't mind. I don't mind that. Let's get out of the Mox B5. Maybe not necessary with so much instability about. And we're gonna separate you. Come that way. We'll get on that fort. You guys are separated. Looks like everyone else is, is going to somewhere, doing something useful. Let's unsiege those back. And this 25,000 is just waiting to get picked up. They're just itching to go. Put me in, coach. I'm ready to play. Uh, we are topped up with steel. Austria is a good one, just because they're right next to me. So if I ever need that diplomat back, it's like, boom, instantly back. Boom, boom. Mamluks, I'm probably not going to get more picks on them. Did I ever get claims on Venice? I didn't, but Austria does. Maybe I'll get a claim too. I like that. Claims on Venice seem... Oh, so... <laughs> oh, it's just so much. Get out of here, pop-ups. I don't... Oh, court and country is not so fun anymore. Not enjoying Gordon Country like I was a moment ago. Lorraine Separatists are not my Separatist, so I don't have to worry about you. Uh, let's separate you. Get you back north. And. Hmm. So go that way. Go south. You're on to these rebels. To these rebel scum. You know you are part of the Rebel Alliance. And that your friends are... I don't know. I don't remember what the lines are exactly, but... We're gonna go get them. Heads will roll. Oh, that was a, that was a negative a negative random pop-up. So how close am I? Oh, wait a minute. What am I thinking? I can... So where did I just take all this land? I can reduce the... I can concentrate development. Yeah, I should be doing this right away. 
because that reduces my overextension I'm taking from having those provinces. And that was all I took. No, I took uh, these islands, the Belairs. But no, I apparently I've already concentrated their development, so this is fine. This is fine. And we will raise their autonomy. Do whatever we can, just uh, we don't need rebellions on islands. We already have a lot of rebellions on islands, so I just, I don't need more. Boom, Cornwall. That would be another rebellion on another island. Do have to be around to grab them off here. I can't just immediately sail back. I suppose I could, but it wouldn't be the the, the best use of my my time. Where do you want to go? Back up to Britain? Yeah, I guess so. Seems seems like a a wise place. Oh, they're gonna start sieging back the their provinces. I mean, I got a 61% war score. I could just piece them out at any moment. What do we have for truces? We, we have no truces popping up. Like, I, I'm pretty certain I have all of Europe in a truce timer right now. They they are just unable to declare on me, no matter what. They're just, nope, can't do it, man. Can't declare on them. It's not happening. Try to get both those rebels dealt with. New south, and that's everyone that way. Alright, that feels good to have some stability. Wow, I've actually handled most of the Rebels. I'm seeing a lot of pop-ups from Rebels still, apparently. I don't know what that's all about. Try not to overthink that. Oh, I guess I, I am still smashing them. Smashy, smashy takes time. This is true. This is true. So that would be a pretty roundabout route for you. So you can just run south instead. And, uh... Hmm. Well, they're not really doing anything else. You run back to the capital. Get ready for more rebels. They'll be coming. And you'll go south. Because I don't need, like, 200 or 150,000 troops down in, in uh, Lower Italy. The Italian boot. That's a little bit over there. Time to say hi to the Cornish. And we could be a bit more. Actually, no, we don't. We don't need to separate at all. We're going to bring out the Navy. We're going to go finish off this last fort. I, I have a feeling as soon as we're sitting here that they're going to surrender. No, instead it was Dumfries. <laughs> it was my fort that surrendered as soon as I arrived. What do I know? I can't get across, but we will, we will sail that Navy over. Eighty-five percent. Come on, win, win this, win the siege, win the siege. Do it, do it. What are our siege ticks? It is fifteen more days. Mm -hmm. Oh, you can come up there. There we go. There is their final fort. We'll get ourselves across that street. Into Escher. Out the way. Yeah, I'm not so worried about Ireland. I don't I don't care about sieging you all down. This is fine as is. What is all that? Telling me things about I may have had provinces occupied down there. I was like, yeah, you don't now don't have this occupied. Me lifting these sieges for Castile should improve their relations with me as well. Now, I, I do want to get out of these wars before all these truce timers start coming out. Like, I, I, don't, I don't need them all still existing. Uh, and I'm going to immediately go south. Onto Dumfries. More absolutism. Every single time we're going to take it. Every single time. Back up to the capital. Where did those rebels even... It's the blues of having such a big empire. You can't find where you're supposed to be attacking. Tunis? Tunis didn't go under them? Why? Where's Cassini? How fast can I make this war? Cassini, are you tiny? Hmm. I, I would like to get rid of all raiding abilities. 
all rating because it's 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 what Mazab, Morocco, Tunis, Algiers is all those countries that have the ability to raid your coast and having your coast raided sucks. Sucks, I tell you. We are under that magical 100% overextension. And we have a 20% coming up in Milan. And that's it. 20% coming up in Milan. Nothing else is significant in terms of uh, overextension. So we might just drag this war on with England for a bit longer. I really hadn't planned on doing that. Alright, what would, what would my other options be? Give a bunch to Brittany. That would be an option. Um, let's just take a quick peek. I'm not forgetting someone. Burgundy. I think Brittany would make the most sense there out of any of those countries. I could give Ireland, a whole chunk of Ireland to Brittany. I think I'm going to absorb them, you know, not too long anyways. Oh, don't drag me down into nowhere. So I just can't run across? I can't. We'll get Dumfries lifted up. Oh, and I think I have I have more armies down there to do that. Do -do. So you're only sending eight thousand down there. Or something. We'll, we'll, we'll snatch that win. Thank you. I'll let these guys do a little carpet seat. All right. Okay, grab the group and. Very good. Let's get all of Ireland's siege down. And the Falklands. The Falklands are Hussite. Feels good, man. Iraq. Wherever Iraq is, you're going to come join the cloth. Do I get the uneven, uneven tech for the, for the better cannon? I'll wait a little bit longer, but not a lot. Only a little bit. Only a petite, petite little amount. Wow, we're hammering a lot of rebels. I'm gonna get you training. Income. What? I have no access to you. Hmm. What do I do, Gus? Start a war to get access to you? I, I'll do it. <laughs> like I'm not even kidding. I'll do it. Don't don't doubt for one second that I'll do it. Why can't I actually core these up? Oh, Great Britain has cores on there. That's fun. That's a lot of fun. Yeah, I didn't plan out I didn't plan out my province taking from France well at all. That was about as poorly as you could plan that. So we are gonna go ahead and uh, give a whole bunch to Brittany, which I, I again I hadn't really planned on doing and it makes it longer for for me to absorb Brittany. Not the end of the world. The game's gonna go another hundred years. Probably. Oh, but I got Burgundy to do as well. Hmm. Brittany Burgundy. Ah, whatever. What core is that? Let's get Milan. These other ones don't actually matter. Wow, oh, Milan, you are taking a sweet time. Mox B5, please. So we got 25%. Yeah, I'll give a little bit to Brittany, but I'm not going to go crazy. If I have to, I'll just take a little extra, little extra ducats, hurt them that way. All right. So that's three provinces that save me a bit of coring on Brittany. Now I want to see what do I have claims of anything? Nothing. I didn't make any claims on you. All right. Well, we want uh, do, 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 do. get joined up. That would be. Three 34 overextension. Ugh. With nothing close to being done. Alright, so we'll take off that. It'll be 20. 20 sounds good. 20 is good. 20 is good. And then we'll take money, max money, and who... I don't care about Malacca. I'd more prefer you don't have these cores. Because then I can core it up. You know what? Cornwall's fine. You can keep the core and on Cornwall. I have that cored up just fine. Boom. We have peace. Peace in our time. 
the 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 border gore is real it is a mess but peace has returned um yeah we're not in a rush we're not in a rush for that military tech and Brittany jumped onto Ireland I like that I I am there is some cultural uh, shared heritage there between Brittany and the Irish people like lot, lots of different Celts. I'm trying to remember. They might be part of the what would be the northwestern Celt lines because there's two main Celt lines. It's a while ago that I that I was watching this the series on this, but similar to the way how you have Ostrogoths and Visigoths, which is roughly east and west Goths, you had the same thing with Celts, and they had they had similar. Um, you know, pottery, armor, language, they could they could kind of understand each other, but not very well. But within their certain groups, they could understand very well across dialects. There's your little bit of history lesson. Back to Carnage. I really do need to get up to these rebels somehow. But surprise, surprise, no one wants to give me access. I would only need one country. So that's got to be one of the next priorities, is, is getting access, getting my... Uh, the country <laughs> united up that way. Constantinople doesn't have a cathedral. That seems weird. Oh, well, let's get a let's get a cathedral built in Constantinople like yesterday. Um, taxation. Constantinople. Whoa, one point five seven a month. Yeah, I'll take that, please. Anything else big like that? Production, no big payoffs there. Trade, I, I, I guarantee you there's a couple of trade-offs here. A, tr a trade-off isn't the right word. Uh, payouts, big payouts is what I'm trying to, what I'm trying to say. Army 3,000, yeah, we'll take that in Rome. Rome is my my manpower just producer over here. I'm tempted to, not tempted. I'm doing that right now. We're gonna we're gonna dev up Rome some more. So we'll start with a couple of men and boom. What was that? Five more man? Uh, five more f uh, manpower dev ups? What would you. Manpower pips? What, whatever, the, whatever the terminology for that is. And we're getting a whopping 11,000. 11,000 out of Rome. It's it's only Pesh that it. Well, Pesh is massive. Pesh is basically a country now. Disputed succession, France, Cuba. Oh, come on, France. Do it. Do it, France. Die without an heir. Die with an out, out an air, you can do it. Oh, Russia's got an air. That's unfortunate. So I won't be able to, to take a, a step on them anytime soon. Should have a whole bunch of favors. Yeah, we'll take Ducats from you. Uh, that was like what? Six hundred Ducats I just got from them? We do have two loans. I gotta stop I gotta stop all this spending. What am I doing? I can't seize land. Uh, oh, but I can sail over there. What am I thinking? Okay, you can all join up in Hall. You can go to Norfolk. These armies are done in the south. It really does look like we have some stability coming back. All the islands look clear. So it's Moroccan and Aragonese. We have the one one army down there already. You might as well run over to the Aragonese. Where is it going to be Aragonese? I don't even remember taking anything from Aragon. I gave one province to Castile. Did I not? Maybe that's where the rebels are going to be? Sure, whatever. Uh, I'm not going to rival Muscovy. Muscovy is my friend. We are buds. Gila Bourbon. Can I convert you? Not yet. Yeah, I, I, I think I'm going to have to fire... I have my advisor, my level my level five national unrest advisor. That feels bad, but that's like that gets rid of my deficit. We'll take the inflation guy, and uh, there we go. <laughs> what is this? Lose church power, gain church power. Stability cost modifier. I am not at max stab. That. I'm going to go with that one, please. Where are all five? Five are there. Okay. Too few rivals. Yes, yes, yes. Stop catching my eye, please. Right. 
So I already have a claim there. So we'll take this claim next. Get rid of their coastline. I'll make two. Because I'm gonna I'm gonna take a couple from them. Uh Saluzu. Let's take a look. There are no big truces. It is the Mamluks. The Mamluks are this year. Alright, that's where uh that's where this episode is gonna end. We will kick it off with our good buddy, the Mamluk. Our old good buddy. Old bestest of buddy. You should be heading down. Are they getting there? Are they getting thumped? It looks like they're getting thumped down there. Oh, Mamluk's getting thumped. I've, that's what happens. I cut them up into so many pieces. Um, so these both give me absolutism. But this gives me more? Then yeah, we'll, we'll take more. Oh, I got a... Oh, that's so perfect. Look at this. It has my king on it, too. It's just, just for a little bit of uh, poetic justice. Bam! Get out of here, rebels. No, there's not going to be any great Turkish revolt. No, sir. There there will not be. We say no to your, your proposition. There's 40,000. You might as well come over. Train there. The rebels will come. Wherever they, wherever they will, they will come. It's, are you forts? That might be the only fort. We'll run right across. And we will get separatists over here. So you will need to stay. We'll just beef you up slightly. Just so you can handle the separatists fine. You can come... No, I don't want you to leave there. You can stay there. That's totally fine. This army is in South Africa. They could stay down there too, just in case the British get the idea to come back. Mm -hmm. Cancel army drilling. Yes, sir. Oh, I can't just run over there. I don't have access. No, I should. I should have access. Well, those aren't my rebels. Oh! <laughs> That's funny. Though Those aren't my rebels. I'm trying to go attack people that aren't my rebels. I'm just itching to get at them is what it is. And these guys may have just got stuck. I'm not sure. So we'll just get them running again. Remotivate them to move. I actually wouldn't want France to fall under a personal union of me. It would mean that it would be a, a longer time before I could uh, start integrating. Which we're going to start doing with Castile right now. That's going to be a long time. What are they saying? What are they saying? What? 1818 to into What? Because my diplomatic reputation is so low. Oh, that's great. That's great. It's like, yeah, this is going to take a long time. Well, let's, let's get the Diplo guy back. Oh, that's funny. We're going to make money at least now. Let's hope the, the diplomatic reputation goes up when this when this rebellion thing's done. And that was an instant siege they took. Instant siege. Head down to the Mamluk land. When did I see? That was November of this year. So you can stop training. You're coming south to Rome. Oh, we got a couple different levels. West. I'll use I'll use them to, to ferry on over. They can keep training. Uh, that is not the Mamluk, so I'm not worried about it. Trade range. No, I'm gonna need my next tech. Mm -hmm. The Hasite Cup. It must go everywhere. Sixty-four thousand manpower loss. Well, luckily I had two thirty, but that's still a big, big, big hit. E even for a big empire, that's a massive, massive hit. Uh, oh, so you're not actually needed over there. That's all right. And you can run south to where that other. Oh, because they're they're landlocked there. They can't actually get out. That's funny. All right, so we'll, we'll get you out. That's not an issue. And 
we're gonna want our one diplomat to come home for sure. Castile has some some stability issues. A little bit of stability issues in Castile, not a big deal. Gotta love that. So you're both south. You can get to Rome. Get down there, ship, sir. Get down there in a hurry. We're still training. And it is two months out. We'll be declaring war and uh, finishing this episode. It's been a productive one. We've been just grabbing and expanding every which way we can. We've got the we've got the aggressive expansion calming down a little bit. The, the overextension, I should say. I should say, it was a little little mad lad for a bit there, but we're we're calming things down. 86%. That'll go down even more because I just concentrated development. 66. There you go. So it doesn't wait till that to the month. Uh, no, I'll I'll take two mercantilism. That should put me at the hundred percent. Excellent. That's what we like. October. Oh, my mistake. I can't count. I, mean, I just I can't count. Apparently, that's just beyond me. You are heading down to Rome. And a free base tax in Constantinople. Sounds like a win to me. I'll just pull out a hundred ducats out of there. Thank you. <laughs> Ooh, what? Truce expired? That is the end of the truce with the Mamluks? Huh. And that is the end of this episode. Thank you for making it to the end. Comment, like, all that great stuff. We... Now that we have the, the the absolutism going up the way it is, we're going to be making some serious gains in these in these last so many episodes. And I say last because even though there is a ton of land still to take before we have these clean borders, and I want clean Roman borders. Not I'm going to form Rome before uh, before I have the clean borders, but I'm not going to stop playing until I have clean Roman borders. And you can see that I've I've already taken all north germany like well onto the coastline so clearly my intention is to unite europa under under the uh the roman banner or the, under the hunnic roman banner until next time you have yourself a great day goodbye